Hi guys, it's Anne Crafty Kimchi. Welcome back to my channel. I have a small collective haul today and uh, let's get started. Let, I have a small mini scrapbook.com haul and I just want to show you some of the stuff that I did pick up. I need to stay away from Tim Holtz and his lives and his drops because every time he drops something I get like <gasps> flustered and I like totally want um the products anyways he did show i forget which live it was um this i think the name of it is bubble layering stencil and he showed it in one of his lives and honestly i when it comes to the christmas holidays i love mixed media i love texture paste i love all that stuff so i've been loving sprays as well so i thought i'd give this a go i just love kind of like that mismatch bubbles so i'm gonna try this one out I also picked up these flowers and these are the Prima 31 flowers that come in that collection. You can see the spider web paper here and then the little jack-o'-lantern paper there and then the mix of the black, the mustard and the pink flowers just totally so pretty and I do love the centers of them. They have that little bubbly finish and then some of them are just um i don't know if there's any oh yep just like a rose so this is such a pretty set and then based well, after watching one of his lives i was like i need this this is a new distress texture set and it's the icicle crackle paste and the snowfall grit paste and i'm so excited to play with this i know one of them this is the one it finishes translucent translucent and it gives a crackle finish so i am so excited to play with that and this one is the grit paste and it, it's kind of like a chunky snowy finish um so i'm excited to play with this i cannot wait and hopefully with the new stencil and just embellishments that i plan on creating so i also have a um hobby lobby haul and i've been watching all of you youtubers and all of the great items that you've been picking up i didn't go as hard as i wanted to on the sizzix and the dye sale there were a lot of new dyes but thank thankfully in my stores they were sold out so i stuck to what i really really have been wanting and it is this uh tim holtz um embossing folder and it embosses a snowflake and cuts it out all in one which is golden because you honestly just crank this one time and you get an beautiful finish so i did cut it out in two different papers i honestly think that any embossing folders it looks better on some shimmer paper so this is on some pink shimmer paper or some foil paper because it really does take on to the embossing so beautifully and I'm obsessed you guys I think this is a great set to have and I can't wait to make embellishments like even just stacking up two different versions or two different colors I think it's gonna make such a pretty fun embellishment I cannot wait to get playing and I did pick up some paint you guys I picked up some acrylic paints because they were on sale as well this was last week unfortunately I did go over the weekend to my Hobby Lobby um, and I picked it up it is far for me so I don't get to go very often so when I do go I like to have a list of items um, that I'm gonna buy so this is uh, seashell pink and it's the folk art brand and I've seen Frank Garcia use this pink color so often that I totally needed to have it. It is like a baby pink. So he uses it. I wanted it and I bought it. Um, I also picked up an ivory white. I think this is going to make a perfect um, white. I just need white for Christmas. And I picked up this one. This is called Sky Mist. And the new uh, Christmas Sparkle collection does have some blue notes to it so i wanted to pick up a blue paint as well because um in the event i do need to alter something so that is that something boring but i always pick up um these glue sticks i usually like the longer versions because i hate refilling it or in the middle of a, of a gluing job and you need more oddly enough oh i just noticed that the back says 5.99 and the front says 4.99 i'm not sure if they put these on sale but um yeah these are just kind of like a must-have 
I have seen so many people haul these and I totally needed them. These little baby deers in this soft pink. <gasps> my heart i knew i needed them and really i was on the aisle for the mini the little christmas section and i could have really gone crazy but i'm trying to form restraint <laughs> i'm doing my best you guys because i do have a lot of stuff so i just wanted to burn through my stash but i plan on using these babies this christmas and i'm so excited they're fuzzy they're pink um they're just so pretty and they have a little built-in dangle so really, what can you go wrong with this little itty bitty beauty? Um, I didn't get that much at the Christmas section. I got these little flat backs again to go with the new Christmas sparkle. There is a lot of silver in there and blue. So I figured this little flat back number was perfect. Um, I got this ribbon and it is a mustard color and I've been really loving the marigold collection and i realized i didn't have this kind of color this mustard yellow so i picked this up really not that much and then i did get these um faceted beads what i noticed when i make my wire wraps that the the bottom bead always seems to slip out so i kind of wanted a stopper bead but i didn't want to use a seed bead because i have no idea sometimes i go too tight and i end up cr crushing the seed beads i've had that happen to me before so um i haven't quite mastered the wire wrap so i thought hey let me get a um more of a sturdier stopper bead so i picked this up in the silver and gold and you get a bunch and when they're 50 percent off this is a steal i also got something sort of boring just i got some head pins because you can never have enough I got them in both colors. I also picked up these eyelets. Um, they're different shapes, different colors. I just thought that these were a fun little pack to have. You got the like stars and then there's some orange colors in here. Some colors I didn't have. I love that little lime green. I wish I had it for Halloween or if I am making another project, I could use that. Um, I did also pick up these bubblegum beads in this black and white set because I really... I don't have that much black so these are 50 percent off so these are a fun bunch and i totally could use the silver and the white for christmas and then save all the black beads for halloween so i bought that and then i picked up some felts because i love using felt i love my bows and felt and these these are really nice um i do prefer the premium one which is a little bit more money and i got two of the baby pinks these are 79 cents but when you make the bow they are so pretty because the felt is a lot thicker um than just this one i want to see if they say it on here how thick this is it doesn't tell you but it is a lot thinner compared to the premium version you can kind of see that here and this one is just kind of a little bit more flimsier so i do love the premium one and again for christmas sparkle i wanted to get my ducks in a row and get um the felts and last but not least i found one by chance one um sale item and this was in the beading aisle this is some bead stringing wire i love this wire for necklaces mask holders i've made bracelets out of these this kind of goes a long way so um i haven't tried this color before but i figured i can't go wrong with it being 2.99 it's always a lot more money so i bought that as well and that is it you guys it's my i wouldn't say mini but it is a fun haul filled with some fun and new exciting items and i hope to be back with a project share very soon thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye everyone